is both. He's great. He's gifted. He's ex he's an eccentric man too. I mean, he's not your everyday you know chalkboard guy coach. All he can do the chalkboard. But you know, everyone talks about Zen Master. He hates that one. You know, when you keep calling him the Zen Master, but. It's true. I mean, his his book, the most ins inspiring book uh, in his life, was the Zen and the Art of the Motorcycle Maintenance. That's his book, and uh, he tries to have a Zen approach to coaching with uh, the triangle, uh, which is a holistic triangle off offense, a holistic approach to the game. But I'll give you a specific example. Uh, a few years ago, when they were in the, the finals against uh, Philadelphia, um, it was Allen Iverson used to wear a sleeve on his elbow. He had a player named Tyrone Liu, who people might remember Tyrone Liu. In practice, he, he had to wear the sleeve like Iverson. So he would do he would use uh, Tyrone Liu to, to simulate Allen Iverson in a practice. Now a lot of people said that was just you know psychological stuff, but it just shows the, the level of detail of how Phil Jackson works. He'll have players do things and act a certain way to try to prepare them for the games. He's always got these players prepared, so he he goes it a, a step deeper. And he is a very, very deep individual. He's, a very, he's written five books. There's not a lot of coaches who've written five books. Uh, a thoughtful guy. We talked about before. He came from an, an offbeat background. I mean, uh, his, his very religious background, Assembly of God ministry. He didn't go. He was in a dance till he was in high school. Uh, he, he had no television in his home. He hadn't seen a movie till he was in high school. Sports really allowed him to fit in. And fit in he did. But then once he got to New York and won the championships as a player, he, he didn't fit in anymore. He was an offbeat guy. He was a counterculture guy. He was a hippie. And he couldn't get a job in the NBA. There were a lot of people who wouldn't talk to him for years when he was with the CBA. Finally, they got the chance in Chicago. Uh, and the rest is history with Michael Jordan. And he, he, he really converted that 